Under the Rural Electrification Program, government and Irongo Red have partially installed electricity at the Ochimbingwe settlement and surrounding areas. However, those without electricity are not impressed because they have been waiting for years to have their homes electrified as well. At a recent community meeting, the Rongo Red Area Supervisor urged the community to highlight their plight in a letter to the Chief Executive Officer. This remark angered some residents who described the meeting as a waste of time. I wrote letters requesting to get electricity. He brought some poles up until Usap 2, that's about three kilometers from where we are. But nothing happened after that. I wrote more letters again, but there were no answers. I then requested a meeting with the former CEO, and they promised to do something. And do that me and what the government Government has the responsibility to provide water to each and every Namibian, isn't it? That's what the Constitution says. So why does the community have to apply for these services of government knowing that there is a community in need of water and other services? So all these three institutions are not doing their jobs. They need to team up and find ways to address the problem. It's so heartbreaking. We have leaders sitting here. Maybe we must encourage each other to take a different route because this thing of meetings and sitting around here will not help. Let's take up some posters and march to the offices because we are wasting time here. There are a lot of people affected. So all these things are problems coming from years ago. I'm sorry to say, but I do not have confidence in the councillor. I do not have confidence in the governor. We are only recovering now from COVID. And I'm not trying to use that as an excuse. No, no, no. I'm just trying to make a point. So, so we, we should not just talk for grandstanding here. We should talk for solutions. It's the time for grandstanding and popularism is over. Now our people need solutions. And that's what we are here for. Residents were advised to establish a committee that would work together with the constituency councillor.